Today, I'm going to show you how to get potato graphics inside of Fortnite. Potato graphics basically give you more FPS, less latency, and less input delay. There will be two potato graphics sections. One with less water, it will give you more FPS, but the graphics will look a tiny bit worse. And then section two, my personal favorite. And it will also give you that distorted skin effect body. So to start off, you guys want to join up my Discord server, discord.gg slash drywest. You probably won't see any channels at first, so what you want to do is just verify by double counter. But yeah, once you've accessed all of the channels in my Discord, simply scroll down into the downloads channel and then hit graphics. And then it should be two links, WinRAR and then NVIDIA Profile Inspector. So to start off, download NVIDIA Profile Inspector.zip. As you can see, it's now downloaded at the top right of your screen. Then download WinRAR. So basically click on this link and visit the site. Now what you want to do is run the WinRAR setup. So click install and then OK. And now you're officially done with that. Open up your file explorer one more time and then go to the video profile inspector. Simply from here, click wizard finish. And then close out all of all the rest of your tabs until you only have your file explorer with three different options here. You're going to want to click on the first one, which is the EXE application. As you can see, it's now open and just click on full screen. What you want to do is click on the profile box up here and type in force. Do not type Fortnite all the way because you actually want to click on Fortnite and not a custom Fortnite. So click on Fortnite over here and it should bring you to these graphics settings. So I'm going to show you how to get the best potato graphics where the terrain isn't buggy at all. So I'm going to show you how to get section one of potato graphics. At the end of the video, I'll show you section two. So to start off with section one, you want to scroll down to anti-analyzing. And then in transparency multi-sampling, it should say off slash multi-sampling. Click the drop down and select AA mode, replay mode all. And then come down into the texture filtering section. Set texture filtering driver controlled LED bias to off. From here, what you want to do is click on the LED bias DX. Click on the drop down and select free. Then do the same for the second one. Click on the drop down and select free. Now from here, what you want to do is click on the texture filtering negative LOD BIOS and set this to clamp. Then set the texture filtering quality to high quality. Then simply click apply changes. So right now, I'm going to show you how to get simple graphics terrains and the best quality settings for this potato graphics tutorial. So once you've loaded into Fortnite, your graphics will be a tiny bit glitchy as you can see. So what you want to do is go to your Fortnite settings and then what you want to do from here, you would either have performance mode on or directs 11. Set this to directs 12 and hit apply. Then restart your game, but I already have directs 12 on, so I don't need to restart my game. So go back to your settings once you've restarted your game and then scroll down to graphics quality. You want to set all of these to low, so make sure everything's off, off, near and low on the last setting. And then set your 3D resolution to 100. Turn nanite virtualized geometry, which will basically smooth in your textures and ground so it's not rough or sharp. Copy the rest of my settings over here and then go into advanced graphics. Turn your NVIDIA reflex low latency to on plus boost. Then hit apply on your Fortnite settings. And yeah, that's basically it for section one of the graphics. Because graphics section two is going to be like what all the famous YouTubers use. And at the end of the tutorial, I'll give you a side-by-side -side comparisons on which one you should actually use. And you can decide from there. But yeah, I'm going to show you graphics section two, which should have a tiny bit better in my opinion. So open up your NVIDIA profile inspector in your task manager again. And we're going to make two simple changes. So what we want to do is go down to the texture filtering. Oh wait, actually search for Fortnite first. And then scroll down to the texture filtering. And where it says free and free for both of these. And type in a custom number. So listen to this closely. It's going to be 0x60. So if 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 zeros. And then 45. Then control A and then copy that. And then paste it in for the second one. So 0x, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 zeros, 45. And then for both of them. And then just click apply changes. Yeah, so for some reason, the spawn island is always bugged. Like, but don't worry, in the actual game, this will be fixed. But yeah, look at the graphics, though. It's actually crazy. Like, the head's normal. The rest is just glitched. Which, in my opinion, is actually a lot better. Because my FPS will be boosted by a lot. Okay, so here we're going to revert your graphics back to the default settings. So basically, search up Fortnite again. Click on it. And then just click on the NVIDIA icon up here. And then it should reset all of your settings that and then just click apply 